Liberal Democrats follow a simple principle that I've tried to keep to throughout my police career, and that is to do what works, not necessarily what grabs headlines. I spent most of my life policing the streets, starting off as a young constable in Holloway in North London, and ending up as a Deputy Assistant Commissioner at New Scotland Yard, responsible for policing the whole of London. I did that because I wanted to make a positive difference. I was a young 22-year-old sergeant battling against a hail of bricks and broken paving slabs when the bricks and riots took place. Days before, I could see that swamping the area with police officers, stopping and searching young men every five yards, was heading for trouble. I realised that what should have been citizens in uniform, the police acting on behalf of the local community, had become an army of occupation. What I learned then, and I will never forget, is the importance of listening to local people and acting on what they want, not imposing what you want on them. And that's what happened 20 years after the riots when I came back to Brixton as the police chief. I got the police and the community working together, standing up against the gangs and the criminals. This summer there was more rioting across London and around the country. People feared for their safety, for their property and for their livelihoods. Young people who had total disregard for others acted as if there were no consequences. And for far too long, the police appeared powerless to stop them. Liberal Democrats want to do the right thing, not the easy thing. Policies based on principle, based on what's right. That's why Liberal Democrats believe in genuine neighbourhood policing, where police officers do what you and I would do if we had the powers and the training to do it. That's why we believe in tough payback sentences, where young people, other offenders, actually give back to the community that they've offended against. We don't want young offenders going into prison and coming out as hardened criminals. We want to stop re-offending. <laughs>